everyone, namaste or namaskuram as I should say because this week in International Club we are learning about India. So maybe you could have a go at making the Indian flag um, which could be quite easy to do and we have a lot of children in this school who are from India but they're mainly, I think I'm correct in saying, mainly from the southern part of India called Kerala but this is all of India, the map here. So maybe you could find out about Kerala or about different parts of India. Maybe you could try making some curry or trying some curry. Who's had curry and really likes it? Or poppadoms or naan bread. So tell us if you've either tried some or you've even had a go at making curry at home. Did you know tea comes from um, India? And there are lots of different types of tea. So have a look when you next buy tea, see if it is actually comes from India. And did you know it grows on a plant and the tea leaves are picked and then dried and that makes tea. Maybe you could see what this very famous temple is called and find out why was it built and what is it called. Uh, here's some pictures from Kerala because it's a very tropical area and it has lots of canals actually and palm trees. Um, but there's also another very famous river in India. Maybe you could find out what that is called. And maybe you could have a go at doing your own henna tattoo on your hand. I'm sure you could probably buy kits where you can make your own henna tattoo or you can find out about it. Uh, they do use them for very special occasions as well. They have very special ones, but they're really beautiful and they will wash off as well. Uh, maybe you could find out about Indian elephants um, and uh, why they are used in very special ceremonies and they are decorated. Uh, maybe you could find out about the clothing. So women wear beautiful, bright colors and can you find out what they are called, what the women wear? Really beautiful. Also, the writing is really different to our writing. They don't have the same letters. So you can see, for example, one, that's how they write one. One, I think I'm gonna have a go at saying Anu, two is Randu, three is Munu, four is Nalu, and five is Aniju. But all the Indian speakers, or Malayalam, I should say, Malayalam speakers in this uh, school could correct me on that. So. That's another thing that in India they have lots and lots of languages and mainly in this school we have children who speak Malayalam but there is also other languages like Hindi and other languages. So uh, really look forward to your photos of all your ideas and things you found out about India.